Hey guys, it's Ty. Thanks for watching The Fumble. For all the latest news on all your favorite athletes, make sure to hit subscribe. And the NBA has finally issued a punishment for those responsible for the fight that took place in Saturday's game between the Lakers and the Rockets. Are you ready for this? Drum roll, please. Coming in at third place, we have Chris Paul suspended for two games for reacting. Coming in at second place, we have Rondo being suspended for three games for spitting. Oh, this confirmed him. And coming in at first place, we have Brandon Ingram, who will be suspended for four games. Now, I do have to say, I'm glad we got to see this side of Ingram. He's not to be messed with, okay? He's skinny. He's ready to stab you in the rib with one of those bony elbows. Oh, you think I don't know what you skinny guys do? No. Now, why was Ingram suspended the most games? Well, just in case you missed it, here's why. Now, the kid fouls Harden, then shoves Harden, then when he gets hit with that tech, he gets all up in the ref's face like he's ready to do something, and that's what led to everyone running over and eventually this. Now, this fight has baffled my mind since it happened, okay? I have watched this over and over and over from every angle, searching on who to really lay the blame on. I can tell you regarding Rondo Spit, it's not Ingram. Let me explain. I'm gonna walk you through this, okay? Now, right after Ingram gets in the ref's face and everyone walks over to break it up, the entire time, Chris Paul is staring at Rondo and then he finally says something to him. Now, Rondo had been minding his own dang business. Okay, Chris, you definitely did the instigating. Now, the Lakers are innocent, all of them, it's Chris's fault. Guys, drop a comment and tell me what you think Chris said to Rondo that pissed him off. <laughs> also, I'll take it because I'm not trying to have any of my Lakers out for too long, but um, anyone else a little surprised it was only a four, three, and two game suspension? No, fine. Like I said, though, I'll take it. All right, guys, drop a comment and tell me how you would have punished those three if you were the NBA. If you want to see more of your girl, you can follow me on the gram and Twitter at Taiwan on Sports. Also, I'm going to be shouting some of you on tomorrow's videos. All you need to do is subscribe, turn on post notifications, drop a comment letting me know you're part of the squad, then just watch tomorrow's videos to hear your name. And I'm going to be commenting back on all of today's videos, so make sure you say hi. Much love, fam.